Okay, so his question was, why did I make a Bill Paxton themed pinball machine? And uh, the deal with that was, it was about five years ago when I was building a Neo Geo machine, and my a, a terrible, terrible uh, confession with the Neo Geo I built, it was Katrina had just occurred. So I'm like, well, if I'm going to make a machine out of plywood, I should do it before the prices go up because of all the windows and stuff. So that was actually why I did it at that time. And so I said, okay, well, I'm, I'm doing this now. I should make a, a pinball machine. So I'm like, okay, pinball, what's the theme, you know? And I thought, mm, Bill Paxton. It was pretty quick because, you know, Bill Paxton is an interesting actor, but he's not, like, super popular. But he's got lots of great quotes in his movies, you know? So there's a lot of stuff to draw from, kind of geeky stuff, too. And it was weird enough to make people say, huh, why Bill Paxton? And that was a big thing. I mean, it's not like I wanted to impress Bill Paxton. I just, the machine itself is the real star. That's just, that just happens to be like an ancillary thing. Um, yeah, and as far as the next one, I'm thinking I'll probably do like a, a Tesla versus Edison steampunk Victorian era machine with lots of brass and gizmos and electric chairs and balls and stuff. So, yeah. Either, so that, you think that'd be better than like a 50 sci-fi movie thing? Tesla? I'm going to throw Charles Babbage in there too, even though he's probably just about dead by that time. <laughs>